Welcome back. Tupelo's new mayor has a new budget that comes in at just under $40 million. WCBI's Ali Martin talks with Todd Jordan about the proposed spending plan. Everything's looking good. This is the biggest budget uh, that we ever had. Uh, there's two, two things there. One is good, means the revenue Revenues are good, but the expenditures are also have gone up. Along with an increase in goods and materials, including fuel, the proposed budget reflects some changes at City Hall. We moved payroll from finance down to human resources. Uh, we thought that was important. Another change will involve separating streets and drainage. Both are in public works with one supervisor. A new supervisor will be hired to tackle recurring drainage issues. If we can have a separate crew, we can do a lot of that in-house, that's gonna help. We have so many projects and drainage is always gonna be one of those that you see uh, when it rains, obviously, and, and floods. The police department's proposed budget is $11.5 million, while the fire department's comes in at $7.1 million. Jordan says there are grants available for equipment, uniforms, and training. The proposed budget does not include a tax increase. Overall, the mayor believes crafting the city's spending has been a smooth process. I think it's going good. Uh, it's kind of what I expected uh, on a bigger scale, obviously, from the county. The budget has to be approved by next week. And after that, there are two things high on Mayor Jordan's agenda, the search for a new police chief and a new fire chief. In Tupelo, Allie Martin, WCBI News.